Pop-Up Hobby Shop, your traveling one-stop shop specializing in collector's items, Pokemon cards, musical instruments, sports memorabilia, and much more. Look up Pop-Up Hobby Shop on Facebook and look out for our booth popping up near you. Don't talk! Woo! 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 Well, fuck. Here we go again, boys. Episode 36, Relentless. Back in the studio. Back with the boys. Back with fucking Charlie. Back with Drew. As always, brought to you by our friends at Tony's Joint. Three convenient locations. Essex, Kingsville, Leamington. Hop in there. Anything. All your dope needs. Um, They got flour. They have accessories. They have edibles. They have the drinks. They have just whatever the hell you want just is in there. So be sure to hop in and check out Tony's Joint. So this we did an epi last week on for our first one of the new year, right? So this yep. is our second epi of the new year, second right? Second one, yeah. Only fifty left to go. <laughs> Only hey, 50 you know what? Isn't it, how remember, many weeks? Me, remember yeah, how many weeks is it? Fifty-two in a year. Fifty-two you know what's in funny? a year. As I, I I realized what happened was because we all are on the account. It was your birthday. Yeah. So it was like, oh, it's your birthday. I thought it was for the fucking page. Oh, okay. So quick recap. Yeah. Fuck your birthday. Um, Drew had kind of said, oh, and, and and posted a few things like relentless one year, happy one year. And I'm thinking in my head, like, it hasn't been one year. We're only on like episode 30. And when whatever. you said, like, you that's said, not a fucking I said something. Year. I'm like, yeah, it's a year. He did go to Western, like, so. I'm like, it's 30 something episodes. You're like, there's 52 in uh, weeks yeah. in a year. I'm like, oh. I felt so. But dumb. I didn't say anything. <laughs> it was it was only, like nobody else said. I was anything, only sixteen so. weeks short. He was close. Yeah. Well, I know we've missed maybe two weeks. Well, we had and the idea. We did and have we had the idea all, earlier. Like, like, I don't even think out, we've missed two like, weeks. We're gonna do we? it, but we didn't do I it. I think there was there for sure was one week I missed early on, and then I think there might have been one other one that was just like it, it, it was on a holiday or something. Before we go any further, have a oh, rip like, of that like fucking. A week that uh, we missed. Before we go any further, have a little rip of that drink because I know it's okay, cares yeah. about this stupid drink. Just okay. shut your face. But um, the the Tony's okay. joint ad. Go ahead, Cam. Have a rip. The Tony's joint ad actually ha- got me thinking about um, what your guys's like favorite weed smoking story. Like just sometime you were smoking weed. It's like your favorite oh, past boy. story about smoking weed. All right, I'm gonna try this drink. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. It's a uh, maple crown with yeah. ginger ale. Yeah, remember, I haven't tried it. Yet. Tell me what it remember, tastes remember like. at Harold's house when we were fucking. We just when he lived his, like when Ronnie and them lived on the park. Right next to mm-hmm. Think, think about a big old um, plate of pancakes. We were fucking. Oh, remember we were in the backyard, pancakes. off like where the track and the soccer field. I was is, gonna say like maybe. And we were smoking. The cop and the cop was riding his bike in between the curbs. They have those big rocks, so the cars don't like drive through like grandstand area. So it was a parking lot. Yeah, the, the, the arena. The sorry, I missed Harold. the beginning yeah, part. Sorry, I so at Harold's house, where his where Ronnie used to live. Okay. So I used to hang out with Ryan, which is his older son. Well, we were all in the back smoking weed, in which is his backyard is open. So you could see the soccer field. You could see the arena. It was all literally right there. There was a cop riding his bike, and there was, like, the curbs. And then in between the curbs, they have those big-ass rocks. Like a little boulder. Like little boulders. Yeah. Like, not like little, they're like probably, a big yeah, rock. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're probably about this big. Yeah. So the cop's riding his bike and goes to fucking jump over, like, the rock, hop over the rock. Front tire goes over. Back tire hits. Fucking pops up. He does a front flip. Lands right on his face. No, his frame hit on the rock. L- right on his face. Yeah. Jeez. Is the wheel that popped him off. But oh, I remember you guys vividly. Were blazing, like, so we were smoking. We all started time. laughing. Well, they fucking he had a partner with him. They doubled back. Me and Greg Ryan just got up, started running for mm-hmm. no reason. And everyone's like, where the fuck are you going, <laughs> man? We're like, well, out of here, bro. Like, just just when he crashed? Yeah, thought, yeah we all they, started laughing. Around and they started, because they could hear us laughing. Oh. So we just got up and ran. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And everyone's like, where the fuck, <laughs> why are you running? Like, what are you doing? Oh, That's hilarious. It was, it was funny. It's not very, like, not every day you see a cop just fly off his bike ass over tea kettle either. So. I was I was on the way to work one morning, and this isn't a weed story, but it's an ass over tea kettle story. And... This, you know, you see him in Windsor, the guys riding bikes, you know, boozers, you know, usually they got like a case of empties attached to the back Scooters? of their bike. Like, take, no, like uh, a regular yeah. bicycle, right? I call it, it was the morning. So he's kind of like uh, riding next to the curb, trying to like stay close to the curb to stay out of my way or whatever. Right. And I can see he's kind of like wobbling. 
this and that. And sure enough, he wobbles a little too close to the curb and his wheel bites and he goes ass over tea kettle and just face first plants into the street. And it was so funny that I couldn't even laugh because I would have felt bad. Like right away, <laughs> I was just like, oh, oh shit, damn. I would have laughed. But it was like I saw it happening. <laughs> I felt so bad for the guy, man. It was I, I'm hilarious. terrible because I do that. <laughs> that, that laugh I do. Oh, and I can't. Where is it? I can't. No, you know you're I fat when you can't see it. I can't see it. So. Oh, there you um, go. But yeah, I'm like, I'm rude. I'll laugh right in your face and not mean to. And then be like, oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. Because like I get that initial reaction. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, Funny. Yeah, weirdo. Fucked. So I was smoking weed. I think I would say uh, we were in Quebec City for like that. Your first time? Uh, the only time I've been. Oh. What do you mean? No, I meant it's your first time smoking weed. No, no, no. Oh, okay, okay. My first time smoking weed, like, I don't even think I really got high. I don't, like, it was kind of like. I remember I smoked a scat behind his house in, yeah. like, the trees area back there. Out of his parents' And everyone bowl. says you didn't get high. You don't get high. In your first... I was high as fuck. Yeah. Big You've time. heard that before. There, yeah. Yeah. Scat yeah. rolling us dubs. <laughs> I was toe like, up. <laughs> no, my first times <laughs> were, because, like, in grade eight, in the middle of grade eight, uh, my family moved from Harrow to Amherstburg, and. There was a few times that I had smoked before that, and then I didn't for a while until I, like, you know, met a new crowd skateboarding, and, th and that's when I, like, remember getting baked for the yeah. first time. Do you remember the first time you smoked weed with your dad? Yeah. Oh, yeah, 100%. It was uh, I, I, Harrow Blues Baseball. I remember mine, like, yesterday. We were on a Harrow Blues Baseball tournament, and me, Ronnie Bastine, who was a buddy of mine, terrible baseball player, <laughs> but was on the team because it was, like, and uh, Brandon Crow, oh, fuck who? Uh, I want to say Jeremiah Motruck or or another another fucking uh, jerk. Another dude. That name but my dad had fucking gave them Brandon A some joint? weed to be like, hey, can you roll this for me? Like ten minutes before, right? Okay. But then I'm fucking smoking weed in the car with Brandon, so my dad rolls up oh. and is like, hey, what's going on? Like, he let me hop you. in on there, and he literally gets in and then goes like this, and like Ronnie's in between us, so he gives me a look. And he's like, what the fuck are you doing in here? And I was like, hanging out. Trying weed for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> hanging out, playing Nintendo. Do you Nintendo? remember the first time you smoked with dad? Our 18th birthday? That, that I smoked. I was before that. Well, that, you, you were at Corey's, Corey's, right? Yeah. Do you remember the, You remember the situation? I remember my situation. Like, So my dad's friend, Corey Burdick, still like one of the coolest dudes on the planet. When I was younger and first started smoking weed, it was I would him, go to Corey's house. Him and uh, who was the other one? Who? Who we'd burn with all the time. Corey, Uncle Bob. Yeah, Uncle Bob. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uncle Bob, yeah. But Corey Burdick, when, this is when I first smoked with Dad. We were there for a barbecue. I smoked with Corey all the time because his son, Terry, is our age. Yeah. And he smoked with his kid. So I was always hanging out there with Terry, and I knew I could smoke weed there, so I'd go there. I remember we were there for the summertime for, like, a pool party type of thing. And they lit a joint, and Corey, fucking Dad's friend, literally lights the joint, passes it right to me. I'm like... Your dad's my, right there? Right right there. My dad's in a circle. I'm the, He handed it yeah. to me starting like... Yeah. So he's, my dad looks at me. He's like, you can have a toke. Bro, <laughs> I took a toke when I blew that cloud <laughs> yeah. up. He looks at me. He's like, yeah, that's your first time. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? He's yeah. like, yeah, that's yeah, your first yeah, yeah. fucking time. Remember? And then that day, we smoked probably 10 joints that day. Oh, yeah. Th since that day with my was dad, a, he was yeah. passing me joints yeah. like in the car. Yeah. And, yeah. you know, it was nonstop. For Remember when yeah. we fucking... Uh, just broke the egg. Broke yeah, the glass. He too like came over the one day. He had a like smoke pack and yeah, it was like twenty five joints, of, full of J's. Twenty five joints he yeah. had because they were going away or something. Or no, he literally filled no. the whole smoke yeah. pack. Yeah, that joints. was the night yeah. that That's Keisha's mint. car caught on fire. Yeah. So no, that was the night we sat downstairs and Vicky was at work and me, Brandon, and Dewey fired away about twenty. Yeah, of I know that, but I'm saying like I remember there was a night where. Brandon and did the same thing. He brought a cigarette pack full of joints to our house. We're like 14, 15. And fucking, Surely. we smoked literally all these joints. Because it's summertime, so we just went outside and hid in the darkness and got high as fuck. Yeah. We come back up. We're sitting in my room or upstairs. Him and Brandon were sleeping. We yeah. just heard it. We just heard an alarm, yeah, like, like a faint. The windows open upstairs, you could just hear. Like, like a, a faint horn. horn. We're like, what the fuck? Like a so car horn? Yeah. yeah. So we went downstairs and we're looking around because we thought there was an yeah, accident. Yeah, we could just see a glow. Sound like an accident. And when we turned to go back to the house, you could see a fucking glow. So we ran to the other side, which is past our neighbor's house. And where Delta Drive is, is where they lived. Their car was on fire. 
full blown right next to the house. Yeah. And the horn was going on. Yeah, and the horn. Yeah, we had so to like hot. run in the house and be like, "Hey, fucking yelling at everybody." Your car is on your house. Or no, we went. House. We had to literally. I had and to. Keisha, I remember had to go into his house. And Keisha be like, was hey. awake. Keisha was awake, and I remember she was just like she woke up. And she was like right next to it, like there's where the, yeah. the couch was. She was uh, fell asleep on the couch. There's a window there. Well, she woke up and was like looking out the window, just sitting there, not saying anything, just staring at it because she didn't know. She thought she was asleep, right? She's, like zoned out, yeah. just fucking staring at this. Looking shit. at you, like you just asked her a math no, question. No, she's just or staring at yeah. the Bro, fucking. Well, I had to literally yeah. outside, just looking at the fire. I literally just walked in their house. Yeah, at like one so o'clock did she in the just morning. Just get home in the car, like so. No, it, well, it they were all sleeping. I'm not gonna say. Yeah. Somebody uh, lit it on fire, yeah. but somebody oh, maybe someone fire. didn't really like because it. Because that cops was a nice came, car. Because the cops said something to us, and then I'm not going to say his yeah. name. He got fucking pissed that we were talking yeah. to them. But, like, dude, all I did was tell him that I fucking heard it. Yeah. That but, was it. But that yeah. was like a nice fucking car, though. Yeah. That's why I had a yeah, hard time man, believing that it was too. like. But yeah, it was crazy. We just walked in there. I was like, hey, uh, yeah. your car is on yeah, fire, was bro. Fucked. Like, I was fucked. That was a crazy one. That yeah, was a good one. Yeah, that was like yeah. the first real like. I remember one fire, time fire too, like that that I seen. Like, I'm I was sitting standing there next to it. Fucking Brandon and Drew. Hey, Brandon and Drew went uptown to get weed one day, and fucking it's funny. Vicky how, calls. So, quick, quick pause for a sec. In Harrow, we called it uptown. Yeah. Where most people would not say down. Would it's say uptown. downtown. For us, it's or, uptown. Oh, it was always uptown. Uptown. Yeah. It was always uptown. Yeah. But it's funny how like. No one else calls their like core of their city uptown. uptown. No, yeah, unless right? you have to go up to up to uptown. Yeah, yeah. For us, exactly. it was just such. But with Harrow, it, it was, was always oh, let's go we uptown for lunch. Right let's now, go it's uptown. like thirty five hundred so or maybe four thousand people. <coughs> but when we were kids, it was like two thousand people, twenty yeah. five hundred people. Yeah. So it was small as fuck. So we would just mm, get zooted and we're, fucking yeah, go uptown. But anyway, anyway sorry. Sorry. Your story? so they were going uptown. For we're me, no, but we're means. there. These guys are going uptown for for weed or whatever. Well, Vicky calls and it's me and Dewey. Oh, out the house, okay? Dewey. So Vicky Derek calls. Dewey? No, Dewey. Oh. Derek. Derek oh, Fox. Okay, sorry, okay? Sorry. so it's me, Drew, Brandon, and Dewey. This is a funny. Story. So, Dewey fucking. Uh, so Vicky calls. And and work. and fucking Dewey's like, we, we were what do there, I do? We yeah, it was only us four had to be there, like, because she we worked because we she had a car at that time, and she and she worked nights. Oh, you weren't allowed to go anywhere. Yes, yeah, she worked night. No, we she didn't but want us going anywhere. Going anywhere because for what she's, reason? Because she, she worked because she worked midnights, and, yeah. and it was a school night, and she worked midnights. Oh. And, so anyway, so she fucking calls us. Okay, okay, okay. So she calls us. These guys are uptown getting weed. It's like eleven thirty at night. She calls and she's like, what are you guys doing or whatever? Dewey answers it. We're ripped. Dewey answers it and she's like, oh, what are you guys doing or whatever? Dewey's like, oh, nothing. We're just hanging out. She's like, where's your brother? <laughs> and he's like, in the shower, right? I heard him in the shower. Yeah, so yeah. so, so I knew Vicky was asking where fucking Brandon was. So yeah. while I'm sitting close enough to Dewey, I could hear Vicky on the phone. And then she's like, well, where's Drew? And Dewey's like... Uh, in the shower with them, <laughs> with them, with them, with them. Oh She's like, so Vicky's like, so Brandon and Drew are in the shower. <laughs> he's like, yeah, and I'm sitting there going, no, oh my god, and fuck it. oh yeah, we got in shit. She was funny because she, she was she was a hard ass, but like, yeah, she was like chill as fuck. It was so weird yeah. her dynamic. It was I don't know if I ever met her. She was not like horrible. She was like. Like any other she parent at that she time. She was strict. She was strict. You know, yeah. she she had her two boys. She was raising pretty much by herself. She yeah, yeah, yeah. But strict, but, but but like would let you still do. But yet, yeah. like we if were, we were just hanging out night, there, and we were teenagers doing at the anything, time. Yeah. And she comes home from work early one night, and we're just and we got blazing. the basement door open, high as fuck, smoking a hundred doobies. And the house reeks like weed. Yeah, and she just walks in like nothing happened. Yeah, she didn't yeah. say fuck, a word. Yeah. Didn't say a word to yeah. us. No, my folks were like that too. Like you know, they understood. For me, that it's gonna happen, but just do it. The they would rather me do it there. Yeah, I'm the same. Be, and my yeah. grandma, I had always told, like the first time she caught my dad smoking, <laughs> she fucking made him smoke a pack, and she was like, "You're gonna smoke. You're gonna smoke sitting here in front of me." Like I told, or my if you're kids. gonna drink, you're gonna drink here in front of me because I, I know I can keep you safe. I, yeah. I had the conversation and, uh, with Jace because he's he's 12, and I said to him, I said, we're, "Whatever came up," and I said, "Are you gonna smoke weed?" He's like, "Jace, yeah." He's like, "Yeah." <laughs> like he hasn't yet. No, How old he's he now. Oh, he's twelve. twelve. Okay. I'll punch his head in. Oh, so yeah. I have. Uh, yeah. I have a nephew who's in high school, going into grade ten. So I don't even know the exact age. Was sixteen? Fucking yeah, fourteen. And like, in grade nine. I don't feel like he would. 
he would barely even like they try to get him to have a sip of alcohol and he's like no, Jay's kids that's thing with Jay's, some kids just Jay's don't want it yeah. it's just not it's, for it's, them. I don't, it's I don't honestly agree with based on your it's way, based so. on your parents too like my kid like Jace has there's no alcohol and he doesn't see anybody drinking he sees me smoking weed like yeah he knows I smoke weed so like it'll be like that he'll he probably yeah. will drink eventually obviously because every yeah. kid drinks because yeah. that's the easiest thing yeah. to get not now back then it was alcohol yeah. you'd have to still like, lose Luke and his and his now cousins weed will be is like, oh, can I have some can I like oh can I have some of that and I was like no no oh because we were bowling for New Year's Eve but they hadn't brought the pop out yet but they brought like we got a couple yeah. pitches of beer yeah. I'm like oh can I have some can have I have sip? some sure yeah, have a sip yeah, yeah. there you go you little wow, bastard beer's Try fucking it. terrible yeah I know but, it's disgusting uh, the funniest the a funny story was uh, the first time my mom found out I smoked weed which was clearly a lot after not that like I hit it but like even when I went to Amherstburg and was smoking weed I didn't like I was like I'm not going home if I'm smoking because I my parents will find out this was before the whole thing with my dad mm-hmm. but after that um me and my buddy mark redpath came stopped at the house to like grab some stuff and i was fucking baked out of my mind and my mom was just looking at me in the eyes like oh yeah where are you going and like smiling and i'm like oh we're just going to get uh, we came home to do the and she's laughing right in my face yeah. your mom like, i remember totally your parents caught. both being big burnouts back oh they are burnouts yeah. and but like my mom does grew your up mom kinda, still smoke Oh yeah, yeah okay. oh yeah, mildly like yeah, yeah. you know, not she, like back in the day, obviously. Oh yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. Not, just bones, I don't. No, bones. and they oh, always yeah. did. That's not, yeah, that's a stupid question. They always did, but it was just different as far as like mom finding out yeah. or so. My dad had this back bar room in fucking Am- in Amherstburg where we would like watch sports and we'd stay back there. And so, so what I would do before my parents knew I smoked weed, like my dad would be up till like ten smoking weed, and then he'd go hang with my mom. And then when they'd go to bed, I go in the back room and blaze up. And it's like it already smells like weed, so yeah. they can't tell. Yeah. They would never know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then the one time my mom's back there and we're passing around a joint, and she straight up was like. I can't, I can't watch you. Like she gave me the joint and like, I have to leave the room kind of thing. Like, but she's still, you know, it was yeah, still kind of like, like this you. joke thing. But now but it's then, like now, now it's so it's legal now. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. yeah, It's legal now. So like it changes everything. Like I feel like, like I said, like we used to have to steal liquor and shit. Because remember when mom was, fucking but, found out about us smoking weed? Hammer. No, but remember when she was like asking us about it and shit? Oh, I don't remember that. We're sitting in the living room. We come home. We were, we were with Greg and like Harold, and they oh, dropped us off. Two of the biggest burnouts. And we were fried. Two no. of the biggest burnouts on the planet. Greg, Ron Greg, Harold? No, no, Greg, Ryan. Ryan oh, and, Ryan. Yeah. And okay. Ryan Harold. We were with them, and they dropped me and Drew off, and we're blitzed. Oh, yeah. Okay, like we go in the house like it's <laughs> now when i come to like think about it we made it so obvious we went through like four fucking fryers deep fryers smashing fucking oh, yeah. wings and we fries and whatever kids, bro we used to fucking like use like we deep fry oh, pierogies we'd and crush fries. everything Scat too would come over yeah bro. we'd fucking so anyways we come in the house ripped and we sit down or whatever we're watching tv and my mom starts fucking like at us and i'm like Man, oh, like, she knows. She you know knows. what I mean? Really like, yeah. That's what my mom so, says. Instantly. Then she's like, oh. She looks at me. She's like, do you smoke weed? I was like, no. Like, we all say that, right? And like, no, or whatever. And then this fucking idiot across the room just stands up like, I smoke weed. I'm yeah. like, you're a fucking Because I was done with the fucking yeah. game, bro. Yeah, like, yeah. Be mad at me and get yeah. this shit over with so we can fucking so then move mom on with just our just like yeah. looks at me. She's <laughs> like, so do you smoke weed? I'm like, well, fuck, I guess. Like, you know, <laughs> I, was, luck, I, guess. You know I was with like, him. Like, if you would have been like, mom, what do you think? She would have been like, yeah, I see, know. Like, for me, I was yeah. just at the point where it's I just. It's more about being honest with your parents. I just. Honestly, in, in like my dad, in the time, it was everyone a around respect thing. Dude, I didn't we want grew up with it being it was it was regular. Our parents, our parents would play. Ba- our dads would play baseball, and then yeah, afterwards remember, they'd I'm, stand around, they'd have some beers and smoke and pass around. I the remember, stuff. Yeah. I remember riding a baseball knew and your dad smoking weed in the truck. Oh yeah, oh yeah, all the time. Oh yeah, single cab truck, yeah. bones just fucking blazing yeah. cannons. Yeah. <laughs> But he knew and that my dad smoked, and I didn't. No, and that's how, care. like I said, that's how they kind of they grew up. It was just a mutual thing, just like they would have a beer in between their fucking legs, always. Oh yeah, right, yeah. always. Yeah. Oh, it it was the, the time. How the right? times have changed. Yeah, oh, big time. You know, it's not, but, and now it's not, it's not worth it to fuck around like that, because uh, you know, mm-hmm. you could fuck your whole life up. It's not worth it. Yeah, like for yeah. me, like a DUI, and like I feel like the smoke of weed. Even I don't, I don't. How much? Of I a could pers- not afford it. 
I could not afford yeah. a fucking Ford you know, DUI. I, I, I would be I, fucked. Yeah, no. Same. Ditto. I, I call Steph's dad if I get all fucking wanged. Well, you know what? And like, I'm, him, no, I'm, I'm the, good on that one. I'm, I'm good too. I'm I've the called driver. Him at like, like 4 a.m. So out of everybody, I'm the driver. Like, because I don't drink really. I would rather smoke 100 joints. Yeah. And I feel like I could smoke weed and fucking drive. I don't care if yeah. I smoke 100. Yeah. I feel like I could drive fine. I mean, you could still get fucked. Been do- yeah, I get it. But, but I've been doing think... it for fucking 30 yeah, years. Yeah, exactly. 30 years. <laughs> and the one 30 time, years since so I, was, I was eight. I was going through. I started I when I was 11. told this so story, th- but I was going through. 27 years. A... This dude's loose because I've been smoking. Sorry, it. Mom. I was going through a ride program. Hawk. and it was the first I time I tried blazing. it. I wasn't regular then. I was blazing a hoolie going through and then a ride program out of nowhere. Oh. And, you know, it was right when, right when all this shit happened. And the cop was like, you know, it's the same thing. And I was kind of like, yeah, but is, is it? it? And he was like, yeah. Same and with he me. he was like, next time do it at home. I, I told him I smoked at home, but yeah. I literally I, was just like, oh, fuck. I went through a ride um, when I was living in Amherstburg. This was probably like four years ago. I was going down front road. I was working midnight, so it was like midnight going to work. And it was front road, and then you go around, and then it's got that sharp like S-bend thing that goes then it goes like towards yeah. the racetrack. Yeah. I went around the first bend. You go across the bridge. You go around that bend. As soon as I hit the loop, yeah. right around, you're trapped. There's, yeah. a, there's a ride yeah, right there, I've right? seen them there. So I pull it. I'm smoking. I have it in yeah. my hand, like fucking Lit. smoking. So Lit. I roll my windows instantly all the way down. I fucking put it in my thing. And I pulled up, and it was this there's chick. There's no way you don't smell and it. And it was this chick, right? And she's like, where are you headed? And I'm like, oh, just headed to work. She's like, you're going to work? And I'm like, yeah. So then she's like, she like looks Were you in headed the truck. outwards? I was going towards oh, the city. Oh, okay. Right? Okay. And she's like looks in the truck. She sees my work bag and everything. And I just is like, just looking at her like, and she just kind of looked at me and she's like, um, maybe you should put, like not be driving while you're smoking. Yeah. She said, oh, not, okay. maybe, no, you know, don't be driving yeah. while you're smoking. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, oh, okay. Noted. She's like, yeah. okay, have a good night. Anytime I've ever gotten pulled over, clearly there, it was, there was weed yeah. involved. Remember? I would get the ticket. And then they'd be like, maybe leave the weed at home next time. Yeah. And that's all they would say about it. Yeah. Well, how like, much is a would... ticket? Well, it was like a speeding ticket, yeah. but yeah. where normally sometimes you may get off the speeding ticket. But, yeah. Yeah. you know. Remember when we used to have our own like oh, Harrow fucking ago. cops? Right. Yeah, we yeah, used yeah. to have our own Harrow cops. So Harrow. one day me that's and this guy are fucking that's driving. Harrow police. Yeah. yeah. 501, This is when it was yeah. Harrow police. 503. Yeah. Harrow police. And we were fucking, me and Drew were driving. We were headed out towards... Cargill on Walker Road. It was on Walker Road still. And we're smoking. Subs are fucking going. He's Drew's got the music cranked or whatever. And I'm fucking I look look in my mirror. I look back out again. I'm like, the fucking cops are following us with the lights on. And he's fucking cruising. Flying. And we're smoking. Yeah. Subs pounding. So we fucking I'm pull over. Well, Drew not old, fucking old thinking because he's ripped. He just throws a joint in the ashtray, right? You're like, we're getting ready. You're getting insurance, everything ready. The cop walks up. He starts talking to us. He looks down. He goes, so are you guys going to, like, dab that out or what? Like, <laughs> like that's fine. I was like, fuck. Fine. We're good. <laughs> I know Cam's got some weed stories. When, what about your first yeah, time Yeah, I got a question weed? for you. Are you, yeah, you on? I'm on okay, now. Okay, on. Came on. Did your right. question? Your, did your growing up, your parents, did they smoke weed? Did you, uh, did your mom I, smoke I weed? got a couple stories. Okay, there. let's go. All let's right, on that. All right. So my mom, heavy dope smoker. <laughs> heavy <laughs> dope smoker. Heavy, <laughs> heavy. So like One, every other parent yeah. that has kid from the eighties. I grew up a little rough around the edges. Mom, single mom, four boys, right? Mm-hmm. You know, she smoked a lot of weed and stuff. But uh, mm-hmm. one day she got a little too far. She's uh, Alcoholics Anonymous, right? Mm-hmm. So uh, she, got, she got into the paint and kind of backstepped. And then all of a sudden I uh, got like cops paint. knocking. Huffing paint? No, no. She just dr- was drinking. Oh, okay. okay <laughs> back okay. on the paint. Yeah, yeah, back on the paint. Back I understood what you said. Yeah. <laughs> I thought. So, Sorry, uh, I'm a, I I'm a virgin. So she was Sorry. all messed up. And then... Uh, uh, all of a sudden, cops are knocking on the door. She's passed out on the couch, eh? And then I'm just like, okay, what the hell? And uh, I oh, look man. over. I look. I was 11 Jesus. or 12. I was right, in grade 8. Some, I, I was in grade a- 7 or 8. <laughs> yeah. So then all of a sudden, I was like, look over, and I'm like, oh, fuck. There's like a whole ounce of weed just chilling on the table, oh, right? Shit. I'm like, oh, well, my mom ain't going away. Like, fuck that, right? So I just grabbed it and stuffed it in my shorts. Talk to the cops. I was like, no, she's passed out. She's good. Don't worry about her. She's not causing no trouble. Carry on, right? They just came through, checked the house out. It's like all my brothers and everything were sleeping. They're like, all right, have a good night. I'm like, you too. Whole time, ounce of weed, just chilling yeah. in my fucking drawers. Right? Oh, you know what? Uh, she, oh, she, she got all messed some up. Some reporter her yeah, 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 yeah. I, had a, I had a whole bunch of fucking shatter in my pocket the night I ran a kid over with my truck. <laughs> oh, my Did I tell God. you guys that story? You no, you ran somebody. <laughs> okay, well, was your story, Tech, Jeff? Uh, 
uh, on. Did you smoke? Oh, you have one. Uh, yeah. I'll finish up. So uh, the first time I ever smoked weed. All right. First Did you time take I- that weed and smoke it? No, no, oh. no, no, no. Like I didn't Be smoke cool weed till I was in it. like grade. Nine, Be I like, think. Cool nine or ten. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking teacher. So, so like, what did you do with it? Did you give it back to your mom? Yeah, I just oh, okay. like, I put it back in her stash. Like, like, like my mom, my mom smoked weed my whole life. Loyalty. Right? What a good boy. Yeah. <laughs> like, loyalty, yeah. motherfucker. If it was loyalty. my older brother, that shit would have been gone, though. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but uh, so uh, the first time I ever smoked weed, I uh, was with a kid named Jordan Shaw. And he's like, you got to smoke this weed. And I was like, I, I never want to smoke or anything like that. I'm like, I didn't care for it. And I was like, fuck it. Give me that thing. And I just started fucking. Had you ever smoked smoke cigarettes or anything? No, or? like no. I didn't. St- I didn't smoke cigarettes name? till I was 20. Jordan Shaw? Where's yeah. he from? Uh, Amherstburg. Yeah. His dad's name's Dan. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Damn. So this Small world, eh? I know damn well who that is. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, Sounds familiar. Yeah. Danny you Shaw. know him if you saw him. Danny Shaw, the big. Chubby dude from Amsterdam that used to pitch. Yeah, he pitched yeah. for us in a couple of the fests out in Harrow. You played when you remember the Man, like photo where you were wearing no shoes? Yeah. Danny's in that photo. Yeah. Anyways, go ahead. The, so I, I I smoked no. for That's the first it. time. Yes. And then like I was like, I yeah. wasn't yeah. really high, but like everybody was like excited that I would be high. So I just like fucking played a fool. And then I was like, you know what? I've always wanted to back football for field um football fucking Post oh, yeah, or the post? There, right at the arena. So I just something? fucking start hucking backflips off, yeah. and everybody thought it was crazy. It was a good time. <laughs> I wasn't high as all at all. Um, yeah. The next like, time I, I could, smoked I weed was out of a pop seven. can, though. Do you guys remember doing that Shuck. shit? Oh, yeah. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Tell, come, on. Yeah. come on. Come on. Uh, first come time on. I ever, like, greened out was the first time I smoked a water bong. And, like, I remember we ate, we went to Burger King and, you know, fucking munched out. Next thing you know, I was, like, in the bathroom throwing up a Whopper. Yeah, I was like, but that's the, I think that's, that's, that's the first time I've ever thrown up from smoking weed. Yeah. Okay, well, anyways, that story really quick about me running over a kid. <laughs> um, so one day I was I was when I first started going out with Katie. What were you driving? No, I was sorry, driving my ahead. I was driving my white Ram, the my old white Ram, the one, one that's that all beat up, the one that, that one, the the big dent in the hood, big branch fell yeah, on, because the tree <laughs> fell on it, and fucking. So I was driving. I K- Katie was on the other shift. We just started going out. So I ended up leaving work early that day. So me and her went to a friend of mine's house. I went and picked up a whole bunch of shatter, a whole bunch of shatter in my pocket. Crossing, going down Paulette, crossing Tecumseh Road where Charlie's is, but going away from like mm-hmm. Tecumseh Road. Mm-hmm. The light was green for me. I'm zipping up there, and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, fucking my window was open like this, but it was raining that day. So it was like kind of hard to see. I wasn't like going crazy fast. Yeah, so I wasn't like I wasn't like speeding or nothing like that. But then all of a sudden, like, just come up over the thing and, like, this kid came out of nowhere. He was, like, zooping across the crosswalk and fucking smashed into the side of my truck. So the window was open and fucking glass blew into the the truck. truck? Yeah, he hit the door, like, right on the door. I'm like, you're fucking lucky because another second you'd have been in front of me. What broke the glass? The mirror. He smashed into my mirror. Oh. Hit the side of my truck and fucking. And then, uh, so the worst feeling is I hit this fucking. I didn't know what I, I I didn't know what I hit, but well, I was knew, he on a bike or something? He was on a bike. Oh. So I knew I hit somebody, but I didn't know. So then I pull over right away. You know where that Capri pizza is? Or what what's that little pizza place right there? Where are you talking? Right by Charlie's. South of like going across down Paulette, away from Tecumseh Road. Are you how fucking high are you? Well, we <laughs> just smoked three joints in fifteen Anyways, minutes. Anyways, yes, so. but there's a pizza yeah. place. There's a pizza place right across from Charlie's. That on the side street there on Paulette. Going okay. like towards like Okay. Okay. I'm good right now. I pull over there and I look in the rear view mirror and fucking I see somebody laying in the road. And I'm like, fuck. I'm like, didn't even think had all this fucking shit yeah. in my pocket. Yeah. Go down there and fucking talking to the cops and everything. It's this fucking like 13 year old kid. So he fucking was apparently zooping through the city because he was late to be home. He was not supposed to. He's from the other side of the city. He was where he was not not supposed to be. Was so then not they to? called the cops. Yeah, he was supposed mm-hmm. to be at a friend's house. He was on the other side of the city. Uh, and then his mom and came. And I'm like, oh, fuck. Here we go. She's going to fucking lose her mind. She came over and started apologizing to me. She's like, he doesn't listen. And that's not. I'm like, yeah. well, all I care about is he's okay. So yeah, I just want to get the fuck like, out of here. So then this cop got there. As yeah. soon as the cop got there, he's like, who hit him? <laughs> I'm like, me. <laughs> but then there was like people that stopped. And they're like, no, you had a green light. Like. Yeah. The fuck. Yeah. yeah, we, yeah. Like, people were like, we watched it. And uh, yeah. But anyways, Fucking yeah, crazy. I got away. The cop was like, you're good. I don't need nothing from you. He's like, all the witnesses already told me you're good. So you can go. He's like, if you want to, if you want to get her name for insurance, I'm like, I don't give a fuck. I'm like, I, I didn't kill the kid. Yeah. We're yeah. cool. Yeah. 
can I just please leave? Yeah, I'm like, <laughs> like literally like this, yeah. like a knot yeah. like this or shattered, yeah. Yeah. like a big old fucking. Yeah, yeah. are we good here? Yeah, are we or, good? Uh, and it wasn't yeah, legal yet. Rick, it wasn't so legal. Are we good now. here? Uh, yeah, be like, I got, I got to go. Yeah, and yeah. fucking fuck out Katie's here. like, I just started going out with her too. I'm like, that's so just crazy. This, took her on a drug deal and then went and fucking. Yeah. Married. Well, it's not yeah. a drug deal. I shouldn't say it like that. It was just. But then shattered. it was. Yeah, it was then technically because it wasn't. Yeah, so it was a drug deal. Should we get into some topics here? It's so funny because we haven't even talked about like our I weekends know. or anything. We got right into shit. I love it though. Cause fuck your weekend. Yeah, <laughs> well, I didn't. Sorry. But do fuck Sorry. all. Yeah, I didn't no? do much either. Just Watch the Lions kids win hockey. today. Yeah, kids hockey. Oh, I'll yeah, never do that again. Hockey though. I just did a tongue flick. I'll never. Well, do Luke, that. Luke popped fucking. the goal today. Did he? Yeah, he, it was a, just a. Uh, like Buddy made him, Buddy made a move and and got a shot and the puck kind of trickled through and was sitting there and and Luke tapped it in because I gave him the five dollar incentive for goals. Eh? Yeah, it's but a good one, isn't it? He also, bro, he was he was impressive today because you know I watched his warm up and he looked like a fucking he was buzzing out there. Was no, buzzing. his warm up oh. was terrible. <laughs> like they do the little J fucking uh, the J uh-huh. drill and. He go the first pass he goes to make the puck had had like moved from his stick so he, so he just down. like oh the puck's still here I'm just like oh my doesn't God. even look that's, just that's how you know you're in then one. he you fucking know goes he around sauce, and then going to take here. a pass he fucking misses it <laughs> then you know he does it, so three chances of a, the J drill doesn't get one shot on net because it's like. He keeps losing the puck or whatever. Oh, but what no. happened is because, like, they practiced Saturdays. They were short of goalie. So the coach was like, oh, does, does Luke want to play goalie? So he played goalie yesterday. So it had been three, four weeks since he even, like, touched a puck as far as, like, stick yeah. handling as a player. And then he has a terrible warm-up. So I'm like, oh, my God. But <laughs> Drew's just. Drew is Drew is in one with that mic there. We need to get keep, weights. As soon as I move we need it, to get out, weights on the uh, on there yeah. because just puts anything I can yeah. lay on it just so it doesn't. Well, move. if you push yeah. this part through and then bring it closer, it would have more center. Well, like, it, it can't dude, I haven't. T- <laughs> no, but then pull I haven't this, touched mine. Push once. this part deeper. Oh, okay. like yeah. mine's just chill. And then the weight will be more centered. Yeah, no, it's okay. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, there you go. And then you'll be good. It won't even tip now. Yeah, if it does. Anyway. I've dealt with it like as as being a musician and yeah. uh, one of those band guys. Yeah, you know, it's the gayest but, shit you uh, ever said. But anyways, so anyways, but he had a great game after having that terrible warm up. And you gave him the fucking five dollar incentive, eh? I did, yeah, you know, <laughs> and it. Uh, he you was all over. Start it. working some fucking OT now because yeah. you start burying him. He's like, I'm getting a paycheck. <laughs> Today was the the fastest I've ever seen him skate while carrying the puck. I was like, damn, there's money involved. E today, yeah, I had to tell him quit fucking. Standing out front, banging his stick. I'm like, quit beaver tapping. They call yeah. it. I'm like, yeah, quit doing he's that. Doing he's it. no, but then he's so. This one kid scores a goal. This kid went shelf. I was like, holy fuck. Oh, some kids are gay, right? This kid goes shelf. All the puck goes in the net. It comes out right to E. Well, E shoots it in. Then he's like trying to celebrate. The kid's like, that's not a goal. That's not your e goal. Ethan fucking loses his mind. He was rattled on the bench. Like I had to. Go on the bench and be like, "What is your problem?" And I was like, "Do you know why it doesn't count?" And he's like, "Oh, he's losing." I'm like, "Do you know why it doesn't count?" And he goes, "Why?" I'm like, "Cause the first shot went in." Yeah. You know, you should do is wait a couple of years, and then in a couple of years, you should coach a team, then I'll help you. Yeah, I want to coach, well, but I don't want to coach at this age. Dude, was, we should all do the it. Same reason I didn't want to fucking. I I was okay. gonna be done coaching when Jason was playing baseball and like rookie t ball because kids don't fucking listen. Okay, so we're out. Today, I'm on the ice with him first time fucking this year here, right, here in town. So the drill that I had, my little station was, it was like three cones, full circle around one, full circle around one, full circle around one, pass to the coach, get it back and shoot. That's all he had to do. Ethan, I wanted to fucking, I wanted to put him through the boards, okay, (laughs) because I'm like, hey, guys, watch or whatever, and then I go through it. And then so he goes first. He goes like starts, goes around, gets like three quarters away, turns around, goes back the other way. I wanted and I kept yeah. not I kept telling him around the pile. I had to keep so near the end he finally got it, but I with it was with me like standing there like around, around, go, around yeah. more, around like <laughs> keep going, keep yeah. going. It's oh. funny because you watch it, you're like, This shit's easy. You're not paying attention. Yeah. You're not doing it Meanwhile, right because you're not paying attention. Yeah. But they're they they are just kids and yeah. it's their first. It's time. hard not to get and mad. They're having sometimes. fun with their Fuck friends. Those kids, man. Like Drew's Drew is telling me on the way here, like um he's got footage of us real young. Yeah, remember when we were young, the the ninety one, ninety two tapes? Him skating around and I saw him skating around. Scoring 17 goals a game. 
I'm gonna have to find try to oh, find those those there, yeah. try to find those tapes of us playing. There's like but, uh, no, you think know, about we, it. It was we, full we ice. The same yeah. things. I literally remember um, full ice. Yeah, think about that. Four four years when old. Kids, full four ice. Four years old. We had full ice. Full it ice games. Half. Five on five. It was full ice. There we was no half. Full ice. Yeah. I can re- my only big memory no of fucking pussies. being <laughs> really young and playing hockey was the day I wanted to play goalie. Uh, I signed up to play goalie, and you know, with Harrow's Arena, there was that upstairs where the parents would hang. Yeah, yeah. and I'm the goalie in that net, and I'm literally turned around like waving at my dad. Scores. And he's like, <laughs> and I turn around, and there's a fucking break coming, <laughs> and, and, he, and like afterwards, like, you never fucking playing goalie again. <laughs> but like, that's my earliest memory of hockey. It really is. And then him teaching me. The fucking fake go to the backhand and score, and then I went out that that game and and did it, and it was like that was probably around cry? the same time. Yeah, no, he probably cried. <laughs> he probably cried. It's like I taught He's him proud of me. Tri- 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 Dude, I even think D- like being out there now, like <laughs> the triple D. Being out there triple. nowadays, I feel like my dad's just like, God damn, boy, they can't stop you. So well, when three you skate shorthanded a, goals today. Well, when you skate 100 miles an hour, it's going to fucking... I am 37, I'm, man. I'm just going to trip your stupid ass. I'm playing the best hockey in my life. I'm 37, so... Hey, I, I'm just going to trip you. Hey, man. Actually, I'm not there next yeah. time we play. No? I'm going to the Red Wings game there that day. Well, Charlie's like, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right. All right. <laughs> we got orange next. Yeah, we have blue, and that's probably going to get interesting, but we'll talk about that off the air. Yeah, so let's get into that. some topics. Speaking of us being on hockey, did you guys see Bedsy? Bedsy got rocked. Jeez. Broken Lit, jaw. Uh, well, Brendan fractured. Smith hit him. Yeah. But it, hit. it was a matter of time that he was like, fucking grabs a puck. Don't be dancing up the Dude, middle. He wasn't even dancing. He went straight up. He, he went straight, straight forward and thought dude. he was going to get through him, but oh. he just stood there and boom, put yeah, his shoulder Brendan into his Smith. head. <laughs> yeah. And I knew something right away, right? He stood up. He was grabbing his jaw the yeah. whole time. I thought he had yeah. some teeth knocked out is what yeah. I thought happened. Yeah, typical. But no, fractured jaw. Wouldn't that have been funny? No, it's not funny. Well, he's I mean, okay that funny. he's... But like, if you had lost a couple of teeth, being so young, first uh, half year in the league, he's missing his chicklets. I mean, probably he already is. has. No, no, he's yeah, pretty. Hasn't yet. No, not in the league. But oh. like, I mean, growing up, he's probably lost his chicks. I like, bet he has. Knows. I guess you're wearing a fucking dome until the pros. But I mean, like, you don't wear them when you're playing. You look yeah. at Bertuzzi see, and all that, yeah. and they fucking but you know yeah, that's true. Like, yeah, imagine, you're right. Here's imagine the him looking like Bertuzzi. Thing though, it's not his arms or his. Legs or anything no, like no, that. No, no, Throw on the fucking, sw- throw on the playing. fucking bubble. Yeah, and go. Lionel was wearing the bubble today. Oh, eh? I seen that. He looked good in that. Like, other than he's like protruding from it in every <laughs> aspect. <laughs> the bubble's like an aquarium for his fucking nose and eyes. <laughs> oh my god, I know That's he cool got though, it, man. but I know. I think we used to do the. Have like, you ever rocked the bubble? Half, we did the half cage, half visor, half, half cage on the bottom, like cla- uh, the the Iceland. Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes, exactly. See, I always wanted one of those, yeah. but yeah, we had them. God damn, you I would rock cool one enough. Right now. I'd wear it right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool hey. I had the first ever <laughs> Nike stick, though the Nike graphite. It wasn't a one piece, but it was like a like we bought it. Let me touch your arm. Yeah. <laughs> hey, man. Oh my hey, God! Man. I know somebody that touched it. <laughs> I had one of the first Nike hat set. trick of shorthanded goals today. I just want to say. Not remember, I remember Jeremy Reese was the first person I ever seen that had the fatter off skates. Remember, he had the Nike skates. Oh man. Their Reece, beauties. Reece I have had some those. rollerblades versions of them. I you had do? black Jeremy versions Reece. of Nikes. Remember Jeremy Reese had the white Nikes, the yeah. Federoffs? Yeah. M- remember the gloves I used to have when I played in Harrow? I used to have those blue fucking Nike mitts. Yeah, they were huge, remember? Yeah. They were, were they like white, what? Blue, white and blue leather. Blue and white, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had those in Harrow. No, it's, uh, yeah, and I had the Nikes. It, it had the, like, the Nikes with the bubble circles kind of yeah. in the back. Yeah, mine were black with white, but they were the same. Yeah. Um, those ones skate weren't fresh as the fucking yeah. I didn't want to go all. White. I'm a big Bauer Vapor guy. I love yeah, those skates. Yeah, man. aren't That's those skates like forty pounds though? Like, oh my my rollerblades. I mean, they're from the '90s, but they're the white Federoff ones. But they are fucking real heavy. But I feel like it's like oh, it's I a feel nice like workout. I can do it because I'm it's a, a nice boy. little workout. Gets me skating like go. I feel like at Gordon Bombay, popping. I put him on. You know the scene in Mighty Ducks where they like put on this. Gordon puts on the skates and he's just like. Skating yeah. around yeah. and it's all like memorable yeah, it's, it's <laughs> slow skate. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're like, yeah, I'm gonna win the championship. Got these brand new fucking Bauer Supreme two hundreds. Mm. We're way off. They were the tax. Topic. Tax. <laughs> tax. <laughs> were they? He, he was wearing tax. tax. Yeah, the T one one thousands. That's what. How do you tax. remember that? Because I have a pair. 
Good call. Have you played I, any hockey this season? No. We need a, to rent the fucking you're ice. You're a fucking you, absolute I bum. To, I told him, too, to get the ice because he knows Harold and all them from the arena running leagues and shit. Why the fuck can't he get us ice? I'll yeah, pay. Because so I'll we'll pay. pay. I know, but I don't fucking handle. I don't do anything with the ice. To handle it. Who does? Um, I feel like. Huh? Yeah, no. Yeah, I know. It's, I, what I, is it, I'm, Wayne? I'm, I'm antisocial. Wayne, so. uh, I try to get everybody to do it. I'll pay before I call. Yeah. I just want to get out there with Luke. Uh-huh. I'll give you, I, know, I wouldn't right mind now. going out with E. Yeah, we should it's all more go ice time. with the boys. Let's like, do it. Or when, like, Lee's down, we'll I want. I want to do it, like, ASAP. I'd like to do it a few times. That'd be cool. Cause Anytime. Let's do it. We should talk to fucking what's his name at work there. Um, I got the Kelly number. There. I got the Kelly's number. You want to call the guy? I have the guy's number. Call, call him right now on the shit? air. <laughs> call the guy on the air. Yeah, but here's. <laughs> I think they were trying to get the ice. I yeah. think yeah. when we, I think when we, hey, but I think when we're there, we have to wear like full gear. I don't give. No, you can you can go with. Well, as long as you have a helmet and everything on. Yeah, like coach gear. It's well, like a real coach gear. I know, man. I, I've thought about going like. I got a bunch of lids. Yeah. The half like visor yeah. route, but I'm like, fuck. I take face offs and. I got actually got a really nice Bauer fucking vapor helmet. Yeah, no, it ain't even worth it. Wear the cage. That's what I mean. Switching. I thought to about the going visor. To, going to the half visor. I have a cage like, on my litter now, but if we're going out to play like just us, I'll take. No, it off. for us, yeah, I would rock that off. But in our league, I mean, fuck, it ain't worth it. I only wear it takes helmet, one so little chip of a puck for me. Yeah. I'm not even worried about the puck. It's just like for me, I wear a helmet because I'm scared to fall and like just yeah, the snap. yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't stop that sometimes. Yeah, and and uh, big thing is elbow pads. Jesus, Jace doesn't have full up there. He's got enough that he could wear everything pretty much, but. He had full equipment, but he grew out of it, and he doesn't mm-hmm. play hockey, right? So what's up with this thing? Why does it keep yeah, like? Because it's on the it's the computer goes into like sleep mode. Yeah, <laughs> sleep mode, that. bro. No, you Come don't. On, man, you ever heard of yeah, it? I do. Every every sleep mode doesn't matter. Who cares? Anyways, jabronis. So speaking of that, you two little jabronis. So I had a question for you guys. Um, I was rocking some M M&M and M minis the other day. Yeah. And I was like, bro, these hit so much harder than regular M&Ms. Mm-hmm. And I was I was wondering, like, A, do you agree? And B, um, is there anything in your mind that, like, like you got your original and then you got your revamped and that's always better? M&M peanuts. You know? M&M, oh, yeah, peanut M&Ms? <laughs> that is pretty sick. It was, like, you right off the top yeah, of Do you head. think that's the best M&M? In my out opinion. of all the yeah, because I don't really eat. They that do anymore. have quite a bit of M and M's. What's your almond one? Do they have an almond? They do, I think. My favorite M and M. Yeah, it's got to be uh, peanut M&M? butter. Is there M M&M and M peanut almonds? butter M and M's? Yeah, those are bomb. Those are bomb. I do like just peanut M and M's. No peanut what? butter. M&Ms. Yeah, I know. I know. Yeah, those I said are bomb. It. I know. Yeah, you don't. But the yellow bag. Them. What yeah, peanut butter comes in like an orange bag? I think. But M and M's do uh, mini M and M's are fucking fire, and they hit. Well, you could just take a whole fucking handful and just. It's like they. How does it taste different? Because it's the same kind so of thing. smaller. Yeah, so is it so bad if I smaller. rolled over? Like in what? Bed a, do you, and ate is there a anything else you can think of that's like it's the same thing but it's better? Like like maybe like Reese has a lot of different types yeah, of Reese's, right? Yeah, like, so like right? the peanut butter cups or the Reese's yeah, pieces. Yeah, or uh, like a Reese mini. What you got? You looking for almonds? Do they have hundred percent? They do. Yeah, they yeah, a hundred percent. M and M almonds. M and M almonds. Yeah, almonds those would be dick. big, I mean, wouldn't they? Or are they like just ooh. chopped up? Maybe. Maybe probably pieces of them. Or like, bits? like Reese has like a Reese bar or those Reese sticks. I, yeah. Those mm. Reese sticks to me are just like those old fucking cookie wafers. That yeah. you now, used would to get you rather Reese have school. a big That's ass chocolate bar or or like the up. mini bites ones? I like the I, mini. Like, I'd rather eat a three couple, cups. No, like or, for any no, chocolate. Like bar. Any chocolate. Bar, I would just rather have mini. just like a couple mini ones instead of like a big ass, because then I can eat a bunch of. Different yeah, ones. I end up eating yeah. fucking the same amount. Then it's, I can eat fifteen of them. And if sometimes I want it's to. about ratio. About it. <laughs> sometimes it's about ratio, and yeah. the little ones have a better ratio. Oh yeah, yeah. You as know, far as like, little ones having a better like ratio. Like chocolate to peanut butter, or like score, like score bites, compared to like an actual score chocolate bar is just like you know. Score. I do like those off. ones. That's adorable. I'm like feeling drunk off my, this maple drink. I like to put it on my ice cream too Fuck once it. in a while. Score crunched up score bar. <laughs> it's good Scores shit. Scores are shit. I fucking 
Underrated chocolate bar right there. It's, more, it's no more. like yeah, it's no yeah, it's no they don't have any like mini eat mores there. Like I don't think yeah. there ever was because you got to be a king. Yeah, because the people who made eat more have been no, dead for hundred <laughs> years. <laughs> 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 no, it's because when you Fuck shit you. after you just, just create been selling the ones that they had stocked up and they don't ever expire because they're eat mores. I hate you. No, they're good. It was good, man. I'm telling you. How many have you eaten since? None. You're liars. I would. I swear to God, none. No, it's because it, hey, when you shit, you're just like creating yeah, it your looks own the little same. Like, is, can I eat this? It looks exactly the same. You're a bad child. <laughs> Does Cam have a question this week or what? Is he just gay? Yeah. Fuck your oh, question. Fire away. You, have you, you guys see that uh, Miami alien shit? No. Oh, no. Yeah. See, is that, is that what the shit that happened that. at the mall? Yeah. What's that? So everyone you got a video. I got I got videos. I got oh, I don't sweet. have them already, but uh, that's yeah. all right. You can talk. So like aliens, did you like that? Remember the Vegas alien? We showed that on the show. Remember, people nope. were like terrified of that thing. Oh, Oop. I hear it. I got you. Hold on. Slide it on over. Oh, cut the pig. Okay, on so come on over, baby. So my wife's friend was messaging me last that night, and she was like. Come on, Cameron. You, you're Full a conspiracy screen. theorist. You gotta believe in aliens. And I'm like, I believe in aliens. Uh, absolutely. The way I look at aliens thing is real quick is is if we can survive and live and thrive on Earth out of all the galaxies and everything like that, who's to say that there's not someone there's no else, way there's another not. planet there's that no has way. the same yeah. thing exactly, going on? Exactly right. You know like I mean? it's just, there's no it's way like we Sam live squint. in a Goldilocks yeah. zone. Yeah. So the background of this is uh, there was a bunch of kids allegedly shooting fireworks off. So they the had a bunch of police show up. A bunch of police. That's a all these people are saying that's aliens because of the police presence. Okay. okay go I to don't the sound. Turn the sound yeah. off. Oh, yeah, I okay. seen a video of the, of the above of this. Aliens. It's actually a stunt that me and my band put together. <laughs> Ignore the evidence. So I seen videos of this. Like this is what I saw. But the yeah, guy, I don't whoever did that, that's actually. What did they see? What did they shoot it with? Their shoe? But I don't understand what they're seeing. Oh, that? Yes. See it walking? Yeah. But it looks like people from. The cop car looks like. What the fuck? Did, is there, they picked the most stoned people they could find. <laughs> Do you have Reddit? Look at all the cars. Oh, well, of course they. Why were they the fighting? Because fight. they're fucking. It's not an alien. Yes, it is. I'll fight you. There's no way this white guy was in there. We saw 30 black guys. This guy just happened to be there. It's a mall. Oh. Yeah, it's a mall. Look at how many cops are yeah, there. There's like a million. That's the real Holy fucking problem. Hell. So there's no f- actual footage or con. The real question is: Okay, so where now the fuck's this Will is, Smith at? Show right. me what you it ever fucking the looked of an what alien? they saw. Not from you ever see the sight of an alien? I'm not saying you. Oh, on we. Right. we. Like, how come? How come <laughs> so we have like the best cameras in the history of time? Right. Clearly, and the guy shot it with security his shoe. Security cameras but, are always the grainiest fucking oh footage. Oh my god! So like, my wife's like very against like any crazy conspiracy theory, yeah. and I love it. Right? Yeah. But if you believe Erica in aliens brain. and you believe in all this crap that's been going on, you know Roswell, all this other crap, yeah. right? You've got to know that they hundred percent have technology to completely black cameras? out everybody's phone yeah. and be like, "Yo, I'll take all that data." They yeah. can literally search yeah. you, yeah. ping you off of any like, tower. Totally they already have you. So they're trying no to get your what. mind off of Epstein's list. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Did you? Look, they're just trying to warn us the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> the Epstein's list. I, I went looking for one name and I found it instantly. What? Justin Trudeau. Justin yeah. Trudeau? Nice. Uncle yeah. Trudy. That's Uncle easy. fucking Trudy. <laughs> Trudeau was named. Uh, man, did Trump you see was this shit named. about Stephen Hawking, though? That yeah, shit's wild. Leonardo oh, baby. DiCaprio. Oh, baby. Stephen he Hawking likes, was named. Stephen Hawking but likes midgets. They weren't charged with anything or <laughs> accused of any wrongdoing, <laughs> most of these people. No, but they were, were on the flight it, list over there. Doesn't matter. Instantly, yeah. as soon as your name's on the list, you're like, I've seen Eminem on there. 
<laughs> but apparently there's the list. So well, you gotta imagine like a lot of people that got it is anybody inv- invited for the first time. Like appa- you're probably gonna go. Apparently the list is anybody that was like flown anywhere with them. It may not yeah. have been on the island. It's just oh, a flight any log. those anyone that those girls remember seeing is on that list, right? Yeah. Those like masseuses or whatever yeah. that uh, yeah. are testifying. Yeah. They're massage therapists. Yeah. Massage well, mas- your cock for yeah. money. <laughs> I think we call those hookers. Yeah, yeah. You're a hooker. I never massaged him. <laughs> Just like, did you see? Uh, you forgot smoking lamp. The Rock's back. The Rock Dwayne. did come back. The people's champ. But he's supposed to actually wrestle now, right? He is wrestling. I, so yeah. isn't he going to go? What's the next thing? Is it He said he wanted money to in the sit bank? at the head of his table. Chamber. Oh, it's elimination, it's elimination ch- chamber, yeah. But... Who's the guy he had the promo with? Uh, Jinder Mahal. Jinder Mahal. So yeah. they're thinking he might have a match know, with him. With all this stuff. And Actually, then, I think he. I think that I don't know, but I think it's gonna be. They got to put him in the rumble. So he's got to win just the rumble. Made, is is the elimination chamber? They just made it a four way, right? I have no clue. I think I think Roman's gonna lose the title next pay per view, or at Rumble. You don't think he's gonna lose it to the Rock at? No. WrestleMania? No, it's going to be Rock and Rock versus Roman. They can't have a title. What if it's Rock and Punk? It's not. It's going to be Punk versus Rollins. <laughs> Since Drew fucking Why can't they have a title? CM Punk. It'll be Punk and Rollins, and then it will be Rock and Roman and Cody and... Um, who did I say? LA Knight? Or, uh, I think Randy's going to win the title. Oh, Randy? Yeah. Randy? Like, but not from that Randy Roman, on the fridge? But not from Roman? No, because they're going to have a four-way, so that way he doesn't have to get pinned. Rocking his gut, Zito. And you think the Rock Roman thing is just to like for the bloodline just ahead of the line, table, not yeah. For... yeah, it'll just be ahead of the table type of shit. Yeah. Do you watch more gay porn? A E D A E Dub, or do you watch more WWE, or do you just watch wrestling in general? Fuck yourself, Charlie. <laughs> I love you. Because at um, work, I always see I like you watching it, shit, and it it's always depends. a mixture. It all depends what's on and what I'm doing. I don't know. I don't really. I was telling him I watch. Doesn't what? watch much eight, yeah. WWE. So Ethan, I got now. All he says now, I drank a beer because I keep doing that shit. So yeah, I'm just praying he doesn't say it at school. Maybe at school, I drank a beer. Like, what did you don't do on say vacation? it at school. What did you want for Christmas? I drank a beer. Yeah. What did my dad say? He drank, and then he'll go two beers, three beers. Yeah. So, like, draw a picture of your uh, family. Uh, it's you. This and is it's my like, dad. Got a What's that all around that says, him? I drank a beer. beer. Cans. That's his beer cans. That, that will go real good. Yeah. These are weird. Staff would be super impressed with me. Oh, well, yeah. That's what we live for, right? So you guys think The Rock's going to do what? Nothing. So do you think he's going to win the belt at so Mania? Do you think it's just going to be him versus Roman at they, WrestleMania for no belt? They must no have stopped training for freaking drugs or something. I feel like I heard. Can you the Rock that? is massive. WWE yeah. no longer uh, testing for I forget H-E-H. what it is. But like Dwayne is fucking he turns when he walked to get out. I know door. when he walked out, I was like, "Holy fuck!" Like he was. I mean, he's been like, like that. Yeah, not like that. He wasn't that not in the WWE, but as a wrestler, he he's was been like that in movies and shit. He was in big as a wrestler. No, he got big as Hollywood. Yeah, he what do you? But he, so he may not be taking steroids right now. now. He may I'm have done up, cycles. Uh, I just looked up. Does the WWE test for okay. steroids? Okay. After that, look up the Rock's return video. Can just okay. look how oh, fucking big this is. Drop never. this over here for you, so you can read that. They, yeah. they, 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 I heard they. Something the ratio about, is greater than four, but less than ten. Then you were asking me to Google what? Man? Staff, you know about this shit, don't you? Just type in Google the wrong I don't know if you would early. if you would work in, in a pharmacy, you know about this shit. Cuz if you did, you'd have to pop on here and explain it to us no. or go on Cam's the mic and explain just, it to us. Just go in the Google and type that. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh, I already got it going on, on my screen. Okay, and then just bring up a picture of it. He works out with like chains picture? all the time. Of course of he's the giant. Rock right now? Yeah. Do you ever see how much Where that guy eats in a day? Yeah. That's what there, I mean. Like, there was a fucking video. I'm he pretty eats. sure he's adamant that he doesn't take steroids, but. Hold on. Yeah, okay. I'm going yeah. to get a picture okay. for you. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Dude, he's big as fuck. And yeah. your, and your defense was he re- he works out with chains? No. <laughs> I was making a joke. I was making a oh, joke. I was like, what the fuck? What? But if I went to the gym every single day and was like six foot whatever, and if I was five, if I was paid to be that big, then I would be that big because it's just what you do every day. You work yeah. out every day, and he mm-hmm. he works out three times a day, four yeah. times a day. Like he works out more than he shits. I guarantee you. 
You, you know what you're doing over there, big guy? Yeah, I'm just trying yeah, to pull find it a good out, bro. Let's see it. Let's see that thing. Just, dude, just the rock. The, guy, WWE the rock return, returns. Go to and, images. Yeah. Or just yeah. play yeah. the video. Fuck we'll we'll just play the drop video. the sound. <laughs> hey, we can just drop off the sound. No, right? you're not allowed to do that. They won't even let you have another on the screen. Yeah. So you can show us. You can show it quick. Yeah. Yeah, they're brutal. Look I think it's great. That's that's not from his the return though. That's it. That one, uh, no, but I want to uh, see him like coming happened. out. Like you know what video. I loved you know, seeing yeah. him the most about oh, yeah. it is how many people he he fist pumped and yeah. fucking shook hands with. He fucking dude. I think he stopped he's a couple photos. How much dude. money he's, he's probably loved. making for this return? Oh. Fucking shit. Fun to like small he needs village. It. Like he needs it. He does need it. He's Dwayne. If Dwayne. you were a gazillionaire, you'd need more too. It'd never be enough. Yeah, well, he, I'm sure he has. He enough. would probably be on my top five of people I would want to meet if I could meet anybody. Like, would you suck his dick for a million dollars? For a million okay, of his 10, billion? Ten million. dollars. <laughs> the rock. Yeah, that's a lot of dick. It's the rock. Like, how does that that's just come out of, of nowhere? It's the rock dick. So at least the rock he's dick. That's almost worse than just a regular. It's probably dick. Not the people's that big. penis. It's probably yeah. not that big. <laughs> it's probably not that big. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, what, 15 don't million? Me. No, I don't. don't Drew don't wants know. you to put a number on it. <laughs> <laughs> you offer me 15 million, I'd, I'd think about it. i at least brush my lips against it. I don't know. <laughs> Take a hey, to get a couple of miles down the road. <laughs> Funny. That's horrible. Y'all gay. <laughs> what? Are you gay? <laughs> um, what other thing did you have? You. Something about a half, fuck, okay. half birthday or some shit? So... I just got thinking because you know my oh. birthday is the day before uh, New, New Year's, Year's, yeah. And every year it's always like pushed to the side, whatever. And like, I was like, "Fuck!" I was telling Jake uh, at work, like, "Fuck it, next year I'm just gonna celebrate my half birthday." <laughs> what are you what fucking the... seven? Yeah. <laughs> and I was like, you know what? <laughs> you mentioning everybody half who's, who, anybody young. who's ever lived has has used the half birthday as a a real thing. Like, hey, I'm six and a half. Or I'm seven and a half or whatever it is. But like if your birthday f- happens to fall on a terrible day, if you use your half birthday, like for instance, my birthday is December 30th. So my half birthday is June 30th. Mm-hmm. So it's like that's one of the best days in the, in the fuck of the year. If somebody said to me, come to my half birthday party. I'd be like, go fuck yourself. But why does it really matter what day you fucking celebrate it? It's like because your birthday. So your birth, technically, it's almost I, our so half birthday. So if I could birth, have this banging ass beach birthday, party right on June 30th, that was my half birthday compared to a uh, hey, it's it's winter outside. Come to my house. Could that possibly be the long weekend? That's what makes too? your birthday Leading the best. Into a long weekend. It's, winter, it's terrible. It's cold. It's terrible. If you're gonna throw no, up, everybody's busy the next day for New Year's. Canada yeah, Day okay, weekend. I guess. Charlie, that'd it. fall on Canada Day weekend, wouldn't so it? So I mean, yeah. But our birthday is like Sanco de Mayo, so it's like, do we really want a half well, birthday? Yeah, because you know you need to feel the, how how it our is. Our half to have birthday a would be <laughs> like November. Charlie's got two microphones. Well, really, like it's like we're yeah. adults; we can um, <laughs> uh, pick which day we want to fucking celebrate our birthday, even so, if it's like six months from when you're actually well, that would be should happening. celebrate your well, birthday. Like, at least you'd be like, yeah, come to my half right birthday, guys, man. We're, we're only going to do the half first things. ever person to have a half birthday party. I'm going to do it this year, and it's going to be a banger. No, it has we're to be half a banger. We're going to have strippers and cocaine and okay. fucking... <laughs> <laughs> Stuff's <laughs> like, yeah, bowls you are of weed. not... Well, then I guess I'm I've always wanted to have birthday. a party with a bowl of weed that was just like, here's a like like a centerpiece bowl of weed. It'll be some, <laughs> it'll be some fucking shag. Here yeah. guys. Oh, no, fuck it's that. It'll be the brown I'm funk. Gonna take I'm going to come in and grab a handful and put it in my pocket. I don't take the shag. <laughs> I don't take the shag. Thanks, guys. Yeah, Great party. Too. Gotta go. Yeah. You smoke it, though. Kid, guy smokes more than anybody I know. I don't smoke weed. I don't either. Your nose is growing. <laughs> so is my dick. Oh. <laughs> Pinocchio. <laughs> I'm just yeah, a boy. It always yeah. gets super I'm weird when we get like 16 J's in us. Because yep. Charlie man. just keeps fucking rolling them and lighting them. It's my job. <laughs> you do actually. Job. You do actually. His job like, is come in here. Microphone levels. Well, yeah. they've been set up the last. <laughs> yeah, the mics have been set up the last few times. I know. I can't so. believe it. We come here two weeks in a row, and the fucking microphones are in place almost. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. Um, excuse me. They've Cam been comes like, early. pretty much set up every time. Yeah. No, yeah. Well, the last few times uh, you missed two. like eight in a row. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> last eight times. <laughs> you're lucky we found you. are lucky we even found you that one day. Yeah. Remember when you just went like? You might still be lost if we. 
but if yeah, it wasn't fucking, for that. How many times you missed? Like two out of three weeks. You might we, still be on we, your couch sleeping. He, he's like, yeah, I'll help you guys. I'll work with you guys. Okay. Comes one week. Next week, doesn't show up. The week after that, he's just laying on his couch with his pee pee out. Yeah. yeah. I was literally passed out, actually. I was yeah. like, I skipped yeah. that one. I was like, we were worried about you that day. Did you yeah, fall asleep? Yeah. You guys or were like really worried. I'm like charging my phone like in my back room. Well, because you don't then, say like, anything also, to like, us. Like, at Erica's all. like, hey, they're worried about you. I'm like, what do you mean? And I'm like, it's like Sunday, isn't it? And she's like, it's Monday. And I'm like, oh, that's cool. Yeah. So it's like, oh, like that's good. We're supposed that. to be I recording. And just chilled right through that. Night. Can't so good. I'm yeah. messaging Erica that like, yeah, something's. <laughs> well, because we we're all talking, we're all talking in the chat and you're fucking like in there. Yeah. You acknowledge you, see like, Why you just cut off. It? You didn't say anything. It was just bam done. Oh yeah, yeah, because we had talked. Yeah. And it was like yeah, no, he talked that earlier on in the day with Dumbass. us. Dumbass. And then he then the worst part is he thought it was fucking well, Sunday. You know what? It was a uh, good thing that milk jug found him. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Drew did have that milk you. jug fucking photo. Is your name Emerson? There. Emerson <laughs> <laughs> Luke, <laughs> <is obsessed. laughs> Luke is obsessed with being like Kermit the Frog here. Kermit the Frog, huh? Fuck. Emerson, nice titties. <laughs> Emerson, that, that was funny. That one video. What was that when he was on? What he's what on was like it? Omegle. That they shut Is that, that down. What it's called Omegle. Yeah, Omegle shut down. Now. Is they it? shut down. Yeah, yeah, man. Oh, it's fucking dangerous. Your cam over there clicking away. <coughs> yeah, Omegle got shut down. You're asking for fucking sexual predators. Well, it's all it is is p- dicks. Yeah, sea <laughs> of dicks. You skip. You go from one Indian's dick. Drew knows. You skip it. <laughs> Drew you knows. See another Indian's dick. Yeah, I got a bit. Of, is it like because of like you know like TikTok? The more you like, if you like this no, thing, you're gonna see more of it. No, is that why it's you see absolutely so much random. Dick? No, it's not like it's not. It's, <laughs> it's not like I conditioned my time like, feed. Yeah, yeah. No, it was fucking. Uh, it's just it's like random, right? I've never used it. I just go on and watch people's videos. Yeah. But then you see people sk- skimming through in their videos, and you see that they have to blur it out every other one because it's fucking dudes with their dicks out, just fucking a big old. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, this is funny. Yeah. Um, sound, top. Figure it out. Emerson. She looks right. like Miley Cyrus. Emerson, big old. <laughs> <laughs> he goes like this. <laughs> Pulls up the cucumber. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wiggles it. <laughs> what the fuck? Emerson. You, uh, the one with the black hair is... <laughs> is your name Emerson? Emerson? <laughs> like, oh, good. Oh, that's weird. Fuck. Emerson, big old titties. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is there something left? <laughs> yeah. Oh! Fucking, oh, 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 fucking dicker, boys. Oh, oh. Charlie's fucking. Charlie is tripped in the studio. Unplug the recorder. Oh, fucking hit the Leahy camera. Came? Knocked the camera. Oh, when Leahy? when Leahy came, it was out of he control. He fucked up the whole show. <laughs> Literally <laughs> fucked up the whole show. show. So the Lions won today. Yes, tied Lions. the franchise record. Did we talk about this? No, we have no, not. No, we just uh, <sighs> didn't even mention it. No, we didn't actually. So Minnesota. What do you right? think about well, that fucking? Did you see Sam Laporta's knee? No, I, I was oh my hockey. god! They showed a slow motion Kid, of it. Okay. He looked like oh. a Doctor Seuss oh, character. Like, man, why do we got to do this? We haven't done this in a long time. I know. Listen, it's not even that bad. He's fine. He walked off the field, but he's fine. The slow motion that they showed of it, I was like, ooh, that was like me. He Look was at that down, guy's and knee. I was like, who is that? It was, was like, like a, a fucking yeah. s- he, backwards it, C. He got hit oh. and his leg planted. Just the way yeah, he planted, yeah. his knee bent backwards. They said he's he, he hyperextended it. It's not as bad as they think. He'll take some fucking injections and be back next week. <laughs> yeah, fine. it's playoffs yeah. time. He'll fucking inject so, the shit out of it. When do is they know that who playoff? They got? Yeah. You must know who they got, week, right? Week. Yeah, they have you the must Rams. Know who they got is they got the Rams for yeah. sure. They got the Rams. Yeah, Stafford versus Goff. I think they'll get him. I think they'll fucking win. If Detroit plays our game, yeah. there's no team they that looked, can. They look decent today, man. I'm in Ron St. Brown. Look like a beast. beast. Did yeah. you see that they him in? Uh, him. Ah! Him and look at that. Look at that. Ah. Ooh. Him and Laporta. Ooh. That's a video game leg right Laporta, there. I think Laporta Ooh. needed a touchdown, and St. Brown needed like 32 yards or something for $500,000 bonuses. And the first drive, Stafford's first pass to St. Brown was 34 yards. Stafford's Goff's playing for the Lions off. again? I mean, fuck. Sorry. Goff. <laughs> Goff hit him, and then he got his bonus. And then the next pass was to Laporta for the touchdown, and then he got his too. Nice. Pass no paychecks. You can see because when Laporta got the touchdown, Goff ran over and they were like smiling. Yeah. Everything. I was listening when they were trying to get it to him. And trust me, they they will gladly write that Saint track. St. Brown had fucking a bunch of yards. Like Man, Minnesota looked good, and it's only crazy it's to think they're quarterback. It, and, and Jefferson missed like seven games this year. He's had like a that. thousand yards. Bro, and he's, pff, he's Missed seven games, still had a thousand yards. Why yeah. did he miss? The, like, hurt? 
Uh, yeah, he yeah, had a and, hip and surgery. And or Kirk or Cousins or? fucking tore his Achilles, and if they would have had him, I think I think they would have been a good squad. Mm. They got a good team. Yeah, and they yeah they would have used four different quarterbacks. So did Dallas end up winning their game? Or? Yeah, actually, I don't know. Well, Can you check the NFL right against now. Washington. I mean, Washington. Miami is, is up fourteen to seven on the Bills okay. starting the fourth quarter. Right okay, now. but what other game did you guys want? The well, Dallas like if, game. If Washington won and blah 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 lost, Dallas, Dallas, Dallas won thirty-eight to ten. Okay, thirty-eight so ten. Dallas. Rams so, so Detroit's the only getting one home game. The Rams for sure. beat the Niners. What was the score? Twenty-one twenty. The Giants beat the Eagles. Yeah, but the lot, the Niners probably weren't playing time. their top guys because mm-hmm. they had a shoe in first seed, right? The Packers the beat the Bears, yeah. obviously. Yeah. Seahawks, Titans, Saints, Jets won today. Bill's last game, Uncle Bill, right? Isn't it his last game? Yeah, Bill. I think they're. Oh yeah. Parting ways for the really, pay, yeah? for the Pats. After all this, how long has Bilicek been there? Man, oh, fuck, forever, 20 man. something years, probably. Yeah, did, how about that least. Michigan day, game? Did you, you guys watch? I don't watch college no. ball. The other one, I the don't normally finals. either, but I knew Michigan was in the Rose Bowl, so I threw the game on. What do you need? The oh. um, championship game, I believe, it's is Monday. Yeah, it's tomorrow. Yeah, it's tomorrow. Yeah. But I was watching that game, man, and Alabama was down, but they had all the fucking momentum. And I can't really remember why I didn't watch the game. I got picked up. My buddy Cause he got high. Cause he got <laughs> high. Cause I got high. But uh, then I'm like, what happened to that game? And Michigan ended up winning in overtime. And I was like, holy fuck, man! I can't believe that shit. Cause they, Alabama looked like they had it. All they needed to do, like you know, Michigan couldn't do anything on offense. Couldn't stop them on defense. Mm-hmm. But you know, roll tide. They ended up instead of. Uh, Making a play outside, they tried just a quarterback sneak, and the, and he just ran into a wall yeah. of nothing. You try that, but you know, um, quarterback was a good player, so they wanted to give him the ball, see what he could yeah. do. Mm-hmm. It's funny though, but so we'll see because Michigan has never really won a real national, national championship. Title. Yeah, because mm-hmm. they never used to have that championship game, right? Mm-hmm. I think that game starts at seven thirty. I yeah, believe that'll be good. And they're we'll be watching it at work. Texas or who they play? Washington. I think. Let me check. Check it up. Who? Check it. Michigan. Who's who are they playing in the? Who cares? The national title oh. game. Yeah, they're playing. <laughs> <Washington. laughs> they're playing <laughs> Washington, <laughs> and both teams are fourteen and zero. Dang. See, Drew, you should give a, a stunner Why right would here. That not the, be a good game. I wasn't listening. What you say? Both teams are fourteen and zero. Washington. What? What do you got to say about that? What? Fourteen and zero. Good game. It's going to be a good game. It's going to be a good one, huh? I'm going to follow it and I'm, I'm down there, man. Are you actually going to watch it? No. Maybe. We'll We're be watching it. it at work. I'm sure yeah, the guys will have it on at work. We're just teasing. Got that IPTV. While we oh, do a, while, while we do 100 vans a, at work yeah. and eight hours they so keep So you guys are supposed to start uh, building the electric charger soon, We right? have started odd ones. Sure. Yes. Odd ones? Just yeah, get, the, trying to get them through. The practice ones or the no, they're, demo no, ones? They're, actual cars. Yeah. yeah I get it's the just low down from it. Robbie Vargas. Don't try to talk to Ro- me like I don't know what's going on. Who's Robbie Vargas? I'm just well, joking. I know who he is. Yeah, don't fucking test well, me. Who the fuck's man. that? Some jabroni. Yeah. No, he's in, I forget what it's called. Uh, his Everybody does. Yeah. He's in stock. Yeah, stock. <laughs> stock, Amazon. All the stock guys yeah. seem to know all the everything. Well, he likes. I mean, he they're never right. Good about you, but <laughs> whatever. I'm gonna tell him that you're. You, you, know, know, you guys you're dick. I don't think. Shit. I don't think. I never said that. I never once said that about him. I do a wrap around. Do a wrap around. A wrap around. Yeah. Fucking wrap you around. Do you guys um? <laughs> you're fucking. Short and gold. Do you um? Do you guys have anything else that no. you would like to speak upon? No. Besides Charlie's I fucking got my socks. Ninja there? socks. <laughs> I'm glad you're wearing your what, fucking girlfriend socks today. Check out these bad boys. I don't even know. Yeah. Do you have a girlfriend? No, I do not. Oh. Single ladies <laughs> <laughs> or guys, whatever. He swings both ways. This is my type right here. <laughs> <laughs> That's your type? Or that. Well, big what, tits with, <laughs> with a big knuckle? Yeah. <laughs> you like that, that pee-pee? That thing's got a boner, yeah, bro. There. <laughs> Some that is balls. Got a little Some dick girls in work there. their vaginas bro, out. Look at what that. Look at that. Look at that fucking thing. That's a mound. That's a moose knuckle. That's a dick, hey, baby. Man. That's how you like it. A little bit of thickness. That's the old tuck, like, hey, you like the thing? <laughs> 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 He's got the chapstick. And the music I'd fuck me. Yeah. 
I'd fuck me hard. <laughs> Dude, that was the first thing I noticed on yeah. that shirt. I'm like, that's a chick with a dick. That's a chick with a dick. <laughs> first this thing I noticed. Fantasy, I think. You're fucked. <laughs> all right, You're fellas. Gay. Anything else, what? boys? Or are we all uh, I tapped out? I think we got her covered. We already did Cam's question, right? We already did that? What was it? Yeah. I forget. Who cares? All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <laughs> we gotta leave. I'm gonna fucking beat the shit out of you. <laughs> yeah, well, you can do that off air. So everybody, until next week, we're out of here. See ya. You need to leave. Peace, bitch. Don't go stopping now. You got so much to prove.